Good afternoon, YouTube. How are you today? It's Valentine's Day in 2022. My name is Wes. I have not uploaded a video in a long time. Actually, on my channel, I only have one video. Um, so that was eight years ago, I think, that when that happened. But it was about LeBron James returning to Cleveland. Anyway, I just want to make a video today about Valentine's Day. Um, man, Valentine's Day. I haven't had a Valentine in, gosh, four years? I haven't dated anybody or anything in four years. I just, I don't know, it's crazy. I feel like women anymore are getting harder and harder to want men that care about them. They claim that they do, but they really don't. And I'm kind of just jumping into that and not really talking about Valentine's Day, but at the same time, I just kind of feel like women just always talk about how they want these good men and they want all this, but in reality, they really don't. They just kind of want a guy that treats them like shit. And that's kind of the truth. Um, I feel like I have a lot to offer. I have a good job. I mean, I don't think I'm ugly. I mean, I, I think I have a really good personality. Um, I'm very down to earth. I'm pretty simple. But for some reason, women don't like that. Um, I see a lot of women who are out there in terrible relationships who need good men in their life to stick by them. But a lot of women just don't want that. They crave the, I don't know if it's maybe for attention, but I think they crave that disrespect, as crazy as that sounds. And I really hate to say that, but at the same time, I don't know if that's a lie or not. So I don't know. It's one of those things. I just kind of sometimes just to understand why men, I mean, I guess you can say the same thing about women too. I mean, there's a lot of women out there that want good men and men settle for women that cheat on them or do whatever, vice versa, you know? But I don't know, just kind of a thought that I had for Valentine's Day. I mean, I'm not desperate. I don't really need somebody in my life, but it'd be nice to have some company every now and then, you know? I don't know. Just people are very, I feel like since I'm a millennial, I can say this, 28 years old. I feel like people my age are very fickle and they're very, they're very fake. I'm not saying people have never been fake in the past generations and whatnot, because obviously they have. But I think a lot of people my age are, especially since social networking's come out as well, people can't hold a conversation. I mean, I was raised with older parents. My parents were born in the 50s and I was born in the 90s. And, um, man, I didn't really grow up with a lot of stuff. I t my parents taught me really the value of hard work and about, you know, if you, uh, you know, you look somebody in the eye and you give them a handshake and you just you do your best and tell the truth kind of thing, I guess you can say, if that makes any sense. I never really had much social networking. I still to this day, I mean, I have an Instagram and a, a, day, uh, a Facebook, but really other than that, I don't really have much. I don't really indulge in that kind of lifestyle. Um, I'd rather get out and meet somebody in person and talk. Um, more talking on the phone um, is more my thing, or meeting somebody in person, like I just said. Um, and not just sitting by a keyboard and doing that way. A lot of our generation has result has uh, has gone to that method, and I feel like that hurts a lot of relationships. Um, and trying to date and just be friends. So I don't know. I just kind of have a thought for today. I don't know if anybody will ever see this video or will comment on it. It is what it is. I mean, you can say what you want. I'm just kind of sitting here having my car warm up on this cold Midwest February day. And I'm just kind of hanging out and just kind of just thought I had a thought in my mind that maybe some people out there are single or lonely or whatever and just wanted to kind of just touch base with those people. So. Reply if you want to my YouTube video. You don't have to. Again, if you don't want to, you can say what you want to say. But um, I hope everybody is safe and everybody is doing well. Keep your head up.